this was like something a long time ago. So I swear to God, like during BF4 Evo, like when I was on the internet, they could say you can see frames. I was like, what? What? I know, I know a couple people who say uh, say they can see frames. I don't think too highly of those people. <laughs> Yo, yo, man, but I, I could break, uh, you know, I could break a 10, um, a 15 frame throw, man. What you talking about? I could break a 15 frame throw every time. 10 frame? No, I said 15 frame. I say 10 frame. 15 is not bad. 10, 10 is, uh, 10 is murder. Oh, my God. And we're going straight into this. Yeah, this is going to be very interesting. This is just a diff two, uh, two different dynamic players. Two different dynamic characters. Pi just wants to get in there. Anytime you make a wrong guess on the punishment, she wants to take advantage of that situation. Right now, Jeffrey ain't, ain't guessing wrong, so right now he is doing dirt. Yo, Blue Lane was fishing for the launcher, couldn't find anything from yep. there. So I'm, I'm seeing that both of them are willing to play from the uh, two or three character lengths away. That's something that uh play a little bit into the match, maybe about like 30% to this matchup. It's mostly also Jeffrey's damage potential. You just don't want to be in there and catch a counter hit anything. And just... At least that she was not at the wall. I won't say this right now, because that could have hurt a lot more. <laughs> Ooh, there we go. See again. She wants to be in, but not in this matchup. You just that's just too risky. <laughs> but he's getting it done. He was looking for a whip punish there, didn't find anything. Four P? Uh, offensive step four P. He causes all of his back. Here we go. <clears throat> Good looks. Oh, with the wall. Didn't catch the he wall. Yeah, they watch tech. Ooh. Misplaced that. All right, let's see if he gets some Okio towards the wall. Ooh, now they're 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 playing a long range game, man. Yeah, they're they're playing 3D footsie. Mm, literally, footsie's 3K closing out game one. It just seems like Pi is playing Jeffrey's game rather than playing her own. This is, this, this is very similar to how Blue Link was playing earlier. Um, playing more spacing game, but defensive game, looking for situations like that, looking for a lot of whiff punishes. So I, I mean, she definitely can do that. She definitely can do it. But I just think in this matchup, when you space and get that right read, I think you should stay a good bit more in, or else you get this. Well, I mean... Let me put a cage behind you and see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> like... Playing defensive sometimes does work, but in this matchup, Jeffrey could just do it so much better with so much damage behind it. Yeah, I was kind of thinking that maybe Blue Link would like to see a stage with a little more room to it, because it's a little too, uh, yeah, too I cramped would, in here. I definitely would have done a stage change, man. Jeffrey on a freaking wall stage is just is nightmarish. I have to deal with the no wall stage. Ooh, okay. Now, here we go. He's in there. Get up, kid. Ooh, just took it. And he's, he's been looking for the spacing on that. That's the second time he's been wrong for it. But uh, yeah. in round, in one of the rounds in game one, he was blatantly looking to whip punish uh, get up, uh, get up kick. So yeah. that's in his arsenal. He's just got to find the spacing. Ooh, all that damage. And yeah, that man's supposed to be dead. Hey, we're getting there. What? <laughs> Double Irish whip? Yo. Really at the Survivor Series. <laughs> no, we're not. No, we're not. You think a German suplex. No, no, he, he Irish whipped him out of the corner and then threw him back in the corner. You know, like throwing him to the ropes. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going back again. Man, I, uh, I just hate this stage in general, to be honest, true. Small, small get out. Uh, I don't think Blue Link is too much of a fan of it right now. Yeah, like, his, his, his face is out. But you know who does like it? RJ, RJ, likes RJ likes it a whole lot, apparently. RJ likes that first round. Oh my RJ God. might be liking his third game, but things keep going the way they are. 2P, catching him after the end of the evade. Getting yet another throw, backing up. And again, he's looking for that space. He just missed yeah. the shoulder lean. Thinking that was a 6KP. And now we got a little bit of a scramble. Yep. Bat dashing into a 2K. Or it might be into some low to close out. I would say it's 3K, but, you know. He back dashed into a low. <laughs> yeah, he did. Ooh. Good poke under 3K. Hop kicks looking for a uh, wake-up attack. Can't find anything there. And oh, again, Blue Link didn't move, but I think that was a bad idea. He's trying to stonewall it. Mm, nice counter. Nothing left for the wall. And there we go. Blue Link takes one back. 
Понял. Coming again with uh, PK starting that round off, and again we see Blue Wing playing from long range. We have it on Talon. We have it on Talon. I think he was trying to duck that. He just Talon? couldn't uh, couldn't find the time for it. Pretty much. He's really playing aggressively against all the wake up options. Yeah. And it, uh, it paid off this round. He's going to get that read eventually. That's what he's banking on. He's going to get this man to stop. You know, get a kick. Just get to a normal stale quick get up or regular get up or roll back. He doesn't really want to deal with people doing something that's kind of not predictable. He's trying to find something to cover all bases with his get up kick. Yeah, how much do you value P and QP right now? Because that's what that entire round was. Uh, I think that time he just felt that, you know. You know, everybody's been in the arcade, you think the person next to you just hitting buttons. And he's like, man, bump this. If you gonna hit buttons, I'm gonna hit buttons. So 2P, of playing, 2P, 2P. So instead of playing chess, they both decided to play checkers. They're playing a, they're playing a barre. They're just trying to create a barre play. That's what it was. 2P, no no real smart reading, yo me. No, just 2P, a barre play. <laughs> Catching up in the game for it. Yo, air to air. <laughs> Yo, this is not Street Fighter. This is not anime games. No. But, but that was a step kick. This is one of the kids' step kicks, right? <laughs> oh, my God. Yo, when we going to see the uh, the DP tech? DP throw tech? Dude, it's too late, man, nigga. I think Yuri is in this game. Then he got headbutts. Against his wall. Yo, this toss is destruction. Rude? Ready? RJ with a quick uh, two rounds in game four. Uh-oh. Got him moving forward. Ooh. He's not oh stopping. my god, there goes his jaw. Yeah, he's, ooh, ooh, he's he stepped, messed up. Yeah, he stepped over into that uh, ground throw. I think he da inputted a dash during that, it seems. Possibly, that could be the, his undoing right there. Blue Link on the board in this game. Ready, go! My phone is kind of slow right now. Good back dash, but can't find too, too much. You get a little bit of a stagger. You see a lot of back dash step kicks. Ooh. Get him out of here. Okay, who we got coming next? That's three one. That was three one. one. Three one. Yeah. That was a that was a brutal three one. <laughs> you just what? Oh my. Okay, God. Lamar does not know how to use technology. Apparently, Lamar does not know how to use techn technology. He breaks computers just by looking at them. Mm -mm -mm. Man, being a command line man, like how I play video games. <laughs> Very